All right, so we're gonna get started with the F100 for the day. We're uh, still been working on it here and there. I got the transmission pulled all the way out. Looks pretty I'm good. I'm now painting the grill separately. Painting the bo bottom side of it too, and now all the little details. But now I got to on the Ford lettering. Got to really clean that up, make that a nice, good black line. Uh, been working on the fender here. Just threw some paint on it just so it wouldn't be rusting until I could work on it again. Got on this line. Radiator support still needs to be painted, but that'll probably be next weekend. Got this side all painted up still. Anyways, we're just gonna have to do the fine details. I'm just gonna use the same paint I used on the uh, splatter paint for this. Just gotta get that nice fine line of black and white. Once you get a good solid line where you need it, I'm gonna go ahead and use bigger brushes to fill it in. Finish it off. Oh god, that was a lot of paint. Didn't think there was that much in it. Uh, there's some more bracking. Damn. Oh, clear. I'm clear to go. All right, so I got it all painted up. You see, it ain't perfect, but got a little bit more touching up to do to the Ford letters. As you can see, I had a little spot of black on it, but I might just sand it and repaint that those spots. Ford letters, I, I think it's gonna look pretty good once it's on the truck and behind the radiator. It'll just be the floating letters. Might paint the inside part blue. I don't know. This was a uh, county truck at one time. That's why I had this. Letters. But yeah, looks pretty good. I gotta put the new put the gas cap back on. All right. Uh, like I said, I really need to paint. The radiator support inside the engine bay fenders might put a 351 in here or a 460 i think i'm gonna trade the four valve for one of those motors and put a cam and new heads on it paint those down there i'm trying to find fiberglass placement bumper for these i don't know if i've found any yet well i don't know if they make any i haven't found any yet uh, I threw some paint on this just for the rust protection. And yeah. I don't know. I think I might need a new fender. Just go ahead and get a new one. <laughs> just paint. And the F100 again. Got it all prepped up and ready to go. Paint the side. So, so then the front clip will be complete once I put the hood on and the grill. Well, the hood ain't getting painted, but the grill. And... But before I do that, I'm going to paint the engine bay and the radiator support black. It's going to look pretty good, I feel like. Just got to get this going, this side here painted. The door, I'm not paint, I'm painting the column. I'm not, I'm fixing the cab, but not right now. Just going to paint to about here. All the way up. 
the door. I'm not painting the inside or the door jam like I did on that side. I'm just gonna go ahead and do the whole interior I want. But for now, just let it be. Uh, the bed I'm not worried about right now. So, and I'm gonna be finishing up the grill. I just had to wet sand it. Cause a little bit of the black was on it and I retaped it up. So I think it's about ready to paint that too. All right, so painting the F100's been going pretty good. We got the side finished up pretty much. Going down, going down, we got the column. Down here, around, down, smack around. Could pull the tape off, but I'm not going to. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Inside it didn't fuck with, so, all there. Door panel I'm not taking off and doing until another time. About ready to, let this dry fully, and I'm gonna tape up everything right here, and then down to probably about here, somewhere, right there on that line. Maybe, I don't know. And then everything in there is gonna be blacks. It's gonna look pretty clean, I feel like. 